I came up with a lick that's uh, I thought it sounded a lot like a Jerry Reed type of a lick. It uses open strings and some harmonics. And uh, what's cool about this is some of the open strings and the harmonics are actually making an augmented run. And that's kind of cool for open strings and harmonics. The lick goes like this. Now I'll break that down for you. Uh, you start off, and I'll, maybe I'll do this in phases, you start off with your big E open, six string open. You take your second finger on the seventh fret, fifth string, which is an E, an octave of your bottom E, and that'll be your second note. And then you're going to hit your G string open, third string. Then you're going to take your first finger on the uh, sixth fret, fourth string, which is a G sharp, and add that, and it'll go like this. It sounds a little dissonant there, but as it rolls along, it sounds all right. The next part is, after you do that, you hit the B string open, second string. Then you'll take your first finger and you'll hit the sixth fret, third string, which is a C sharp. So it'll go like this. Then you'll hit the E string open, first string. And then you'll kind of take your little finger on the eighth fret, second string, which is a G, and you'll kind of, not really hammer on, but you'll slide up to that G sharp on the uh, ninth fret, second string. So that lick goes like this. The second part of this is the augmented little run. You start off again on the open E, big string, six string, open. This time you'll take your third finger on the uh, eighth fret, which is an F note. Then you'll hit that G string open, third string open. Then you'll take your second finger on the seventh fret, fourth string which is an A, and hit that. Then you'll hit the second string open, which is a B. Then you'll take your first finger on the third string, sixth fret, which is a C sharp. So, so far I've got... See how cool that sounds? It's augmented. With that E note droning against all that. Okay, next note in that thing will be, you'll take your third finger on the eighth fret, third string, which is a, a, a C sharp, C sharp, it's a raised D, so you've got... And then you'll take your first finger on the second string and hit an F note, uh, sixth, sixth fret, second string, first finger, fret six. So, so far we've got. Now we switch to the harmonics. You'll hit the harmonic on the 12th fret, third string, which is a G note. Then you'll hit the harmonic on the seventh fret, fourth string, which is an A note. Then you'll hit the 12th uh, fret harmonic, second string harmonic on the 12th fret, which is a B note. Then you'll hit on the 
ninth fret, this note, which is a C sharp. And that'll be your last note. And then you can kind of just devise anything you want to after that. I, I just kind of went like this. Mm -hmm. 